Hello everybody, I'm Mingo with another massive video. Today I'll be showing some really cool stuff. It's been a while, as you can see my hair has grown since my last video, which is good. This is today's topic to discuss, and that too. This, as you can see, is a lawnmower blade. This, as you can see, is a hard drive. Yes, it's another hard drive video. You can do so many things with them, as I will demonstrate once again. Damn. Beautiful. So it took me a long time to find the right drive for this because we needed one that didn't have a recessed disc. So the lip was all the way up here. It just needed to be like a cover like that. So that, that's how it looks. It's so clean. That's like one of the cleanest looking drives ever. It has a first drive that everything is held together with Phillips screws. Everything uses some kind of stupid star bit. Add that to our collection right there look at it and it just so happens that this fits perfect the spacer ring is a bit too big so we need smaller unfortunately we just so happen to have a whole cup of them now maybe we'll get one even thinner okay that works okay let's check it Whoa! Oh man! Holy crap! Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> it's beginning to vibrate out of my fingers. Okay, it works. I'm also gonna put the magnet in our magnet collection. Yeah. Taking apart a lot of drives. This is like only a third of them. So if we want to power this, we're going to need a power supply for the power supply. And I was thinking of a backup battery, but mine's is kind of buried in there. Go to brother's room. And guess what? You got one too. Anyway, he doesn't need this, or this, or this, or this, as a matter of fact. He doesn't do anything dangerous. So let's just make sure that this works the way I plan it to. It's not plugged in. Battery plus surge. Let's try it. Okay. Let's test it out on one of our drives. Cool, it works. All right, let's go. Well, to make a mount, I'm thinking not to go too complicated, we use a rod, we'll bend it on the edge to make it an L bracket, and we'll use those two screw holes, drill through the piece, and that's going to be our mount. Oh ha, not a hammer. Oh, it's got a mount. Okay, that's good. Okay, we have our stick. Okay, so if you want to mount this, we gotta get creative. Okay, let's 
started. I don't really know how fast the lawnmowers operate. 7200 RPM should be good. Jesus, listen to that. Holy moly, that's skippy. Let's do it though. Much quieter, much more efficient than a normal um, guy. Something is coming loose on this thing, and I don't, I don't know what it is. Now I did notice people really use this for like those angular trimming. So I think it goes like that. Yeah. Oh man, look at that. Nah. It does what it needs to do quite well. And when you're done, pull the cord. You begin to slow down. Now for the fun part, removal. Woo. Good as new. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe helps. And as always, you will see me in the next video. Goodbye.